First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory unto the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, Basham Yoshai, Basham Raka Kodash. I'd like to give double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who well, who teach us is true to the spirit and power of Yahweh, Basham Yoshai. And peace and salutation to Yakim Zemaudi, who pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth. Lady Brother Quara, coming to it another lesson to feed the elect at the house of Israel, the so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American Indians. Now, what I want to talk about, you know, concerning the laws of your Basham Yashai, you know, because, you know, we two thirds of our people, you know, who lost in Christianity, you know, the, the, the take this, this, this grace, you know, like a, a, a get out of jail free card, you know, like, like a, like a monopoly game, you know, that. You know, you could always use your, your get out of jail free, free card. So you, no matter what you do, or you could continue in evil, you know, you just had a pop your, 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 your get out of jail free card. You know, they always look at, you know, that grace. Right? And, you know, they have it twisted. You know, they have it wrong. Right? Because the scriptures, you know, made it clear. Right? Not because grace are born, you're going to continue in sin. God forbid that, right? You know, and a lot of them, you know, they, you know, we two thirds of people, you know, they, they, they look at it like, you know, they, because grace, they, you know, they could continue doing it over and over, continue doing the wickedness over and over and over. Because, you know, I heard a lot of them say, you know, hey, we know that he low again, you know, but by grace, you know. Yeah, we know that, you know, it's not the law going to save us, but by faith in your shy. You know, but the things your shy teach, he didn't teach we to despise the law, that to forget about it because, you know, he, he come, he die for that. He didn't teach us to despise that, right? Because the scripture is showing in, in Matthew, right? And in, in, in 1 John 2, right? Right? If we love him, we keep his commandments. If you want to enter in, into eternal life, keep the commandments. This is what Yahweh Shai teach. See, he came not to destroy the laws or the prophets. Right? So not because, you know, it had a mercy. We're going to continue doing wickedness over and over. You know, we had to cease from, try to cease from sin. Try to do, to keep the laws to your best abilities. <laughs> right? Yeah, we know, you know, we know we're in the flesh. You know, we, we can't keep the law, you know, 100%, right? The, the earth is defiled under the inhabitants thereof. You know, we eat in defiled bread, you know, we, we in this flesh. But that doesn't mean because we in the flesh that we're not going to uphold the law to our best abilities, you know. And there is a show that, you know, two-thirds of our people, you know, are lost in Christianity. You know that they have no faith, right? They have no faith because by having that faith, hey, you will do the thing pleasing unto the heavenly Father. The scriptures say to obey is better than sacrifice, right? To listen to hearken, right? But you know, hey, they despise this, you know. And it have a it have a penalty, you know. It does have a price to pay at the end, right? It does get reward. You're gonna be reward for righteousness, and you're gonna get a reward for your wickedness, because the Lord is of balance, true judgment. This is how the Lord does deal. Righteous judgment. The Lord is righteous in everything He do, and everybody gonna get a portion according to their righteousness and the wickedness wherever. So the Lord is of balance. Right, you know, and these scriptures here is for our learning. That's why the scriptures say in second, I think it's the second Ezra, for the Lord have given straight commandments to such a scheme what we should do to live and what we should do to avoid punishment. A day, a day, the scriptures is there for our learning for we to avoid punishment and for we to live, how to live righteously. Right, but two thirds of our people they despise the law and have a penalty to pay for that. Right? There is Proverbs 13, verse 13. Right? He said, Whoso 
despise it, the word shall be destroyed. But he that feared the commandments shall be rewarded. Right? He that feared the commandments shall be rewarded. Right? He said the law of the wise is a fountain of life to depart from the snares of death. Because once you put your trust in your Hawa Basham your shy and keep his commandments, any father gonna he gonna dwell he gonna dwell with you. Right? He gonna he gonna care for you. He gonna have mercy upon you. To deliver to deliver you from the hour temptation. From these evils to come. Right? So you gonna be rewarded. What you doing, you know, by, by, by you fearing the Lord and keeping his commandments, right? You painting, you painting, you know, you painting that work. And you're going to get a payout. You're going to get paid, right? So you painting that work for your salvation. That's going to benefit you, you know. That's not to say, hey, you're going to benefit the Lord to say, you know, the Lord, he need us. Right? So, this is going to benefit you. They for your salvation. Right? They say save you from that. Right? He say, verse 15, He say, A good understanding give it favor, but the way of transgression, transgressors is hard. Yeah. The way of transgressors is hard. They're going to see it. They're going to see it in these evil times. When great tribulation come. When the famine come. When these wars start. They're going to see how hard it is. When the belly start to crack with hunger and the lips blistering with thirst. Right? They're going to see how hard it is. Because they put not the trust in the living God. Yahweh Basham Yoshai. Put the trust in idols. Right, so we are the transgressors, it's gonna be hard. Right, the scripture saying, um, the Psalms, Psalms 119, Psalms 119 verse. Let's see. Um, you see, I have remembered thy name, O Lord, in the night and have kept. Thy commandments. Say, Thou art my portion, O Lord, I have said, I would keep thy words. Right? So, hey, you gotta keep the words. I you basham your shy. You know, the, the precept I'm trying to get here is, um, One second is yes, yes, yes. Psalm, Psalms one ninety verse. 155 so like yeah psalm 119 verse 155 he says salvation is far from the wicked for they seek not thy statues right so salvation is far from the wicked right as we as we read in in um in proverbs proverbs 13 verse 15 a good understanding give it favor, but the way of the transgression is hard. So they're going to be far from salvation. Right? They ain't going to receive salvation because they despise the laws of your Basham Yoshai.
right? So they ain't gonna up, they ain't gonna obtain that, that, that mercy because what they're doing to obtain that mercy, they do they ain't doing nothing, right? And this don't work, as you know, the old saying they say in a way, one hand don't clap, and they take two hands to clap, right? So you know, as scripture say. You know, they, you know, they that turn away the air from here in the law, even the prayer is going to be abomination. You know, because, hey, they don't do nothing for the Lord. You know, but what the Lord to do for them. You know, that, you know, every time something happens, evil come, you know, it'll call upon the Lord. You know, and, and, and what it, uh, you know, what them business to be fixed. But what they're doing for your Basham, your shy. Right? <clears throat> so, hey, the Lord gonna have mercy upon them that, that fear them. Right? There's, um. There's second Maccabees. Second Maccabees six verse sixteen. He say, um, and therefore he never would withdraw his mercy from us, and though he punish with adversity, yet do it he never forsake his people. Right? So you know, as scripture said, despise not the chastening of your Basham, your shy. You know, in, 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 in weakness, you know, we just be made strong. Right? You know, scripture says, if he be without chastisement, you are bastards and not sons. Because the Lord, you know, he chastises the ones, you know, he love. You know? But he never, you know, he would withdraw his mercy from us. You know, the Lord cared for the elect. Right? And his mercy, you know, enjoyed forever. You know, his mercy is from everlasting to everlasting. The scripture says in um, Psalms. Psalms. Psalms 103, verse. Um, 17. Yeah, Psalm 23 verse 17. He said, But the mercy of the Lord, the hour, Basham Yoshai, is from everlasting to everlasting upon them that fear him and his righteousness unto children's children, to such as keep his covenant, and to those that remember his commandments to do them. Right, the Lord had prepared his throne in the heaven and his kingdom ruled it over all. Right? So the Lord, you know, he cared for, for them that love him, to such as keep his covenant. And to those that remember his commandments. You know, so he so Yahusha didn't you know he didn't say you know he, he, to not to keep his father laws, his father commandments, you know. Tell all you to abide in them, even as he abide in them. Right? So remember, as the scripture says in Judges, you know, any place uh, you know, a, a join water there, we shall rehearse the righteous act. Where is the righteous act? The laws are your basham, your shy. That is the righteous act. They do it to your best abilities. Right? Wisdom of Solomon. Salamon um, 3 verse 9 He said They that put their trust in him Shall understand the truth Right They that put their trust in him Shall understand it Understand the truth Right And the truth Is putting your trust in your Basham your shy You will not have a Right to eat from the, the tree of life by putting your trust and faith in your Basham, your shy. You know, to understand, you know, the thing the Lord promised unto the righteous. Right? As, 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 
you know, as, as a Apostle Paul, you know, he say he know what is laid up for him, you know, by doing this work, by finishing his course. A crown of righteousness with the Lord going to hey, give him. And he say not to him, not to him alone, but for all of them that love is appearing, that do this work. You know, it also, you know, it, it show that, you know, your shy come to crown them. You see that in second just 2 verse 42 chapter, 42 verse. Right? These is the men that stood stiffly for the name of your Basham, your shy. Now they have received crowns. Right? Verse 9, he said, They that put their trust in him shall understand the truth. Right, and such as be faithful in love shall abide with him, for grace and mercy is to his saints, and he cared for his elect. Right, so grace and mercy is to his saints, he cares for his elect. Right, as we don't read in, in, in Psalms 103 verse 17, but the mercy of the Lord is from everlasting to everlasting upon them that fear him and his righteousness unto children's children. Right, he say, verse verse ten, right, verse Amos Solomon three verse ten. He say, but the ungodly shall be punished according to their own imaginations, which have neglected the righteous and forsaken the Lord. So they that we now read, we read in 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 Proverbs thirteen verse thirteen, whoso despise the word of the Lord shall be. Whoso despises the word shall be destroyed. Right? So the ungodly, they're going to be punished according to their own imagination, which have, you know, turned from this truth, which has despised this truth and forsake your basham, your shy. Right? Verse 11, he say, For whoso despises wisdom and nurture, he is miserable, and their hope is vain. Their labors unfruitful, and their works unprofitable. That why scripture show you know. Eh? But the ways of the transgressors is hard, right? But the law of the wise is a fountain of life. That why scripture say you know eh? for wisdom. And knowledge, you know, it shall be our stability in, in, in these times. Right? Hey, we, we're going to look towards the, we're going to look towards the Lord. Hey, we, you know, hey, we, we call upon the name of your Basham, your Shai. You know, hey, we try our best to do the things pleasing unto our Maker, unto the Heavenly Father. Because we know, you know, hey, in these evil times, you know, hey, we, need a, we, we will need a power. You know, we will need a God. You know, hey, to deliver we out of the hands of our enemies. You know, hey, we we care. You know, we do these things ourselves. You know, the Lord. You know, the Lord that is take care of us. You know, so hey, it's Him we are to turn to. You know, but to to our people, you know, all turn into the white man. You know, like like if He is our God, you know, all depending on Him. You know, and despise. You know, hey, your true power. You know, you all have no faith. You know, that your Basham Yashai will deliver. You all have no faith in that. Right? It's, um. Okay, um. Go back in Psalms. Psalms 102. It's 13. Satan verse 12, he said, But thou, O Lord, shall endure forever, and thy remembrance unto all generations. Thou shalt arise and have mercy upon Zion for the time to favor her. Yea, the set time is come, for thy servants take pleasure in her stones and, and favor the dust thereof. So shall the heathen fear the, the name of the Lord, and all the kings of the earth shall glory. When the Lord shall build up Zion, he shall appear in his glory. 
right so the lord gonna have mercy upon zion for the time you know to, 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 to fever her that's why the lord said no he, he cared for grace and mercy for his luck he cared he cared for his sins because they take pleasure you know in in, in pleasing her and keeping the commandments right and fearing the lord right so the lord gonna have mercy upon them he's gonna have mercy upon right upon zion and you're gonna you gonna hey as the scripture say you know when the lord shall build up zion he shall appear in his glory scripture saying that in um uh, i think it's in um get an idea Isaiah 14 verse 1 yeah so he say Isaiah 14 verse 1 he say and the lord will have mercy on jacob and will yet choose israel and set them in their own land and the stranger shall join with them and they shall cleave to the house of jacob and the people shall take them and bring them to their place and the house of israel shall possess them in the land of the lord for servants and handmaids and they shall take them captive who captive they will and they shall rule over their oppressors they're gonna rule over their oppressors you know the school called white man and these heathen nations and the scripture say you know the time will come when the plowman shall overtake the reaper right days will come in right he say and it shall come to pass in that day that the lord shall give thee rest from thy sorrow and from thy fear and from the hard bondage wherein thou was made to serve because we despise the law i our basham your shy and end up in one slavery in hell in a low state right but the lord had not cast away his people which he foreknew you know so you're gonna have mercy upon jacob right so they we're gonna have mercy upon right you see and and thou shalt take up this proverbs against the king of babylon and say how are the oppressor cease the golden city cease you know the, the big apple huh? hey you how about i gonna take a bite out of that big apple right the lord had broken the staff of the wicked and the scepter of the rulers right you see he who sm- he who smote the people in wrath with a continual stroke he that ruled then he that ruled the nations in anger is persecuted and none hinder it he said the whole earth is at rest and it's quiet they break forth into singing to the hood the whole earth gonna be at peace right because the so-called white man is dead right he is hell you know so there will be no more the so-called white man the earth will be at peace right that's why the lord say you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna broken the, the staff of the wicked and the scepter of the rulers you know the scripture said the world is given into the hands of the wicked you know these edomites these so-called white people the descendants that he saw they are the wicked they were created to be the wicked and hey, the lord gonna take him out right and he's gonna be at peace so the same people he despised negroes latinos and native american indians right we are called monkeys and 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 beasts and you know all these proverbs all these by words these are the same people who are gonna rule over you and rule over these hidden nations the same people you all despise right they are the children they are the sons of your basham your shy you know and they're gonna get what was rightfully their own you know they're gonna be on top 
and they're gonna rule right you know and with that i'm gonna hope it was any fine you know i like to give all praises and glory unto the heavenly father yahweh basham yoshai basham akakadash i like to give double honors to the apostles and elders of great millstone rule well you know and peace and salutation to the yaki of them all the who pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth there's a brother quara saying